Well, I'm with Neda Kawi uh, to talk about uh, Certificate in Business Administration, which by the look of the board uh, leads to quite a number of occupations. And Neda, there's quite a number of things to do with business admin, which must mean you guys offer a fairly big range of courses. Yes, we do. We like to consider that uh, students that, that do our course are uh, work ready for any type of industry. Uh, every industry needs an administrator and uh, as you'll see on, on the board here we've got a, a number of different positions that you know some of our students have gone into. Yeah, okay. Oh, they, they are past students on the board, are they? Yes, Actually, they are. Yeah, yeah. And uh, some of the types of positions that students can go into. So anything probably from likes of reception, medical reception, um, accounts clerk, yep. uh, up to a PA and ultimately an office manager. So if I was uh, already found myself a job, you know, I left year 10 or whatever and I found myself a job as a receptionist right. and had developed a fair few skills, but I needed now a qualification to get a job that I wanted to go to. Mm -hmm. Is there that sort of um, option in the business administration course? One of the things we're developing at the moment is offering people that are already in work opportunities that they can get a skill and a qualification for what they're already doing. Yep. So we'd like to be able to go into the workplace and interview the student or the prospective student there, uh, give them credit for what that they're already doing very well and identify any gaps that they had or any areas that they want to improve on and offer them opportunities to be able to fill those gaps and ultimately get a national certificate at the end of it all. Generally speaking, uh, what, what, what are the class sizes that you have at the moment and where do they come from? What sort of students you've got? We've got a mixed range. We've got a number of students, of course, coming straight from school, the second chance learners, and also people changing direction. Mm. So, you know, they might have perhaps been in nursing or something like that, and due to possibly a back injury or um, something like that, they've changed a uh, tack and gone into the administration side. Okay. Some of our students also go on to do things like the diploma and um, also the uh, BIT degree. BIT stands for? The Bachelor of Information Technology. We've okay. had students go on to do that as well. Oh, right. And what do you do? What do you make websites there? Or you fix they, the that, they do, yes. Oh, okay. yes. Yeah. But what we do with some of our computing part of the course is give them a really good base range of skills yes. that can uh, take them anywhere really. Okay, that's very good. Thanks very much. That's fine.